Hi guys, it's me, Canada, from Hot Toy Nation here, and today I'm going to review a story called Fluttershy is the Best Pony by, I believe it's, it's Super Trampoline? I'm not exactly sure if that is the way it's supposed to be pronounced. I know Super's in there, but I don't know about the other half. I'm sorry if I'm saying it wrong, but this is a story that has recently been added on to Fem Fiction. It's a cute... It's a little neat little story. Basically a story about if Fluttershy if Fluttershy is the best pony. Talking about if Fluttershy is the best pony. So the story starts out with sort of a little news almost introduction. It's called, it's, if you guys remember in My Little Pony, and I think last season or the season before that, there was a mention of a newspaper called Gabby Gums. And apparently it's a newspaper put on by... Sweetie Belle, Apple Bloom, and Skittaloo. Um, so that's sort of that's sort of the basis of the story is they're going around trying to figure out why Fluttershy is the best pony. So the story starts off with apparently a banner of some sorts it being posted up that says Fluttershy is the best pony. And so they're going around asking, you know, people, particularly the main six, if Flosh has the best pony. The first person they go to is Rainbow Dash. Rainbow Dash says that, no, she's not best pony. I'm best pony. She's, like, second best, which is kind of mean in a way. Like, yeah, she's, like, she tries sort of, you know, not sounding as rude by saying she's the second best, but it sounds... A little rude, but she in the end, but in the end, they can't. She doesn't really know who did it and why. Why they know, why they think Fluttershy's best pony. So they go to Applejack next, and Applejack has no idea what they're talking about. Um, she tells them um, that it's for the paper. And she apparently doesn't read the paper at all. She doesn't really care. But, so they ask her and she says that, you know, I don't think Fluttershy is best pony. I think a best pony is someone who is hardworking and tries to take care of their family as best as they can. So, so yeah. But in the end, she doesn't exactly know who did it or why Fluttershy is best pony. So they go to Rarity next. Rarity is... She doesn't really give an answer. I don't know what answer she gives, but I don't think she gives an answer at all. She kind of just whines. I guess she's whining that she isn't, you know, best pony or something. I don't really know what her response is. It's kind of confusing for me to understand hers. So they end up going to Twilight next. And Twilight says, no, nah, is not best pony. Best pony is Princess Celestia. Because... She is the princess, and also because she has much charts stating why. <laughs> well, uh, so they kind of had a lost words for her, for Twilight. So the next pony is, which is probably my favorite out of this entire story, is Pinkie Pie because of the way it goes. So when they get to Shoot Cupid, you know, they meet Pinkie Pie, and... They ask Pinkie Pie why Fluttershy is best pony, and Pinkie Pie's response is, oh, of course she's best pony, she's, you know, great and all that, but, um, I don't really know why she's best pony, it could be. Chuck starts talking about, like, alternate dimensions, about, you know, people from an alternate dimension thinking Fluttershy is best pony, and stuff, sort of referencing us thinking Fluttershy is best pony, so it's probably one of my favorite ones, and I know I'm not explaining this entirely well, or if, you know, I think I'm explaining it pretty quickly, but it, but my comment doesn't really do it justice. If you guys want to read it, go read it. It's probably the best one in the entire story, but in the end, her response is too confusing to even, uh, for them to understand. I believe she'd blown their mind, and not in a good way. And the way we're like, whoa, that's awesome. I'm like, uh, my brain's hurting now. <laughs> so finally, after trying the uh, the rest of the main six, they get no answers. So the only person is to go talk to the source of her, the source, the best pony herself, Fluttershy. So when they get there, they knock on her door, 
and they ask her if she's best pony. Well, her response is, of course I'm best pony. I'm like, oh, finally, we have an answer. Okay, why? Well, her response, her response is, oh, because everyone's best. And she's like, she starts naming off a bunch of people who are best pony. Um, a whole bunch of people, even, I think, even her friends. Uh, but she also, one little fact that I thought I mentioned is, I believe she referenced the writer, too. The writer had her in there, had put himself in there. I thought that was a little neat. Um, so, in the end, they don't really get a clear answer, answer on who's best pony. Uh, so, the story kind of ends with sort of a little synopsis that, um, you know, everyone's best pony, meaning everyone in MLP, is just an amazing character and just awesome. And it's actually kind of true. There are a bunch of different types of characters, from background characters, princesses, main six, OC characters from that people have created. Um, so, yeah. It's, um, it's pretty much it. Uh, that's the story, and, um, yeah. If you guys want to, I'm sorry if I'm saying this during the story pretty quickly. I kind of really wanted to get a story out. Because I know I haven't done one in a long time, so I thought it might be, you know, easier just to get a quick one, a sh one shot out, instead of doing a long story. So, um, yeah, um, if you guys want to check this out, go check it out. Um, it's by, as I said, Super Trampoline, and I'm really sorry if I'm saying it wrong once again, but, yeah. Um, if you guys enjoyed this story, um... Go check out my other ones. Um, if you guys want to see more stories, videos by me, um, subscribe to my channel. Uh, if you guys have anything you want to mention the, uh, to me, ask questions or anything, uh, put it in the comments below. I will surely answer. I will answer them. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, I once again, I just want to say. A, about how this story is when it's probably not one of my best videos so um don't worry i will get a better video out there soon um so yeah i'm canada and goodbye for now